Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you're having a great day. So you're shopping for a drone for the holidays, either for that loved one or more than likely for anything like myself, you're shopping for yourself because it seriously is the best time of year to buy a drone. You've probably been waiting for this for a couple of months because as you know, discounts are deep and everywhere this time of year. And so what I'm gonna do with this video is I'm gonna share with you what I think is the best drone overall to get, the best compromised drone to get, and the best drone to get for someone that's never flown a drone before. And then also I'm gonna show you where you can get some of the best specials right now before the holidays. So let's get right to it. Hey guys, thanks for visiting the channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Russ and this is 51 Drones. Obviously this channel is about drones and everything that goes with them. I do tutorials and reviews, comparisons and things like that. And sometimes I do related product tech reviews. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, or if you like what you see today, be sure to click on the subscribe button as well as that gray notification bell. So like I said, it's a great time of year to buy a drone. I actually bought my first drone two years ago this time of year because the discounts were so good and it really was a good time to start looking for a drone. And so I kind of wish someone had made a video like this for me back then. And so that's why I'm doing it for you guys. You know, I've owned five of the best DJI drones as well as some other cheaper toy drones. So I think I would consider myself a good resource for you guys as you are researching this. So like I said, I'm gonna go through what I consider to be the best drone from DJI. These are all DJI drones, just letting you guys know what I consider the best compromise as well as what would be the best drone for beginners. So we're gonna go out of order. We're gonna start with the best compromise first. So like I said, I got my first drone two years ago and that drone was the Mavic Pro. Now the Mavic Pro still remains one of the best drones on the market today. It has amazing stability, amazing control. It was the perfect first drone for me. The obstacle avoidance gave me the confidence that I needed. The intelligent flight modes allowed me to get professional looking footage even as a beginner. With OcuSync, it has awesome connectivity so I rarely lose signal with it. It has precision landing, which was really nice for me as I was getting started. So I had that confidence to know that it was gonna come back home if I ever lost signal. And the reason that I call it the best compromise right now is because although it's a great drone, the image quality isn't quite as good as the Mavic 2 Pro or the Mavic Air. But otherwise, for the price right now, the Mavic Pro is a great drone. And especially at B&H Photo right now, they have it discounted deeply. I think it's discounted like $370 for the Flymore Combo Kit. That's like just over $900 for the Flymore Combo Kit. You're saving almost $400 from what I paid on this drone. So I'm gonna put a link in the description if you guys wanna check out that awesome deal. Now, the next one that I wanna talk about on this list is what I consider to be the best drone overall, the best consumer drone overall. We're not talking about the Inspire 2 or the Matrice or whatever, <laughs> but I really do think it's the best drone. Now, all the people are gonna say that it's the Phantom 4 Pro, and they are kind of right, except for the portability issue. It is big and bulky, it's hard to travel with. You can't just throw it in your backpack or in your carry-on or anything like that and take it with you. The Mavic 2 Pro really is the best drone on the market right now. With a one inch Hasselblad sensor, you're getting awesome image quality. I mean, seriously, the image quality on this is just incredible. You're getting 360 degree obstacle avoidance as well as up and down. As far as volume, it's relatively quiet. It's not as quiet as the Mavic Pro Platinum, but it's much quieter than the Mavic Air. The intelligent flight modes are great and I'm sure they're gonna be adding more as we go through these next few months. The connectivity, is unbelievable. OcuSync 2.0 is so great. I have never, not once, have I ever lost video signal feed with my Mavic 2 Pro. And I've challenged it quite a bit. Of course, always remaining within visual line of sight. <laughs> of course, the disadvantage to the Mavic 2 Pro over the Mavic Pro is the price. You're looking at over $1,500 for this drone, and you're probably not gonna see any discounts this time of year. Normally you would, but you're not going to because it just came out in August of this year. So for those of you that are looking to kind of dip your toes into professional videography and photography with a drone, the Mavic 2 Pro is a great choice. Now, next I'm gonna tell you what I consider to be the best drone overall if you're shopping for someone that's just looking to get into drones or if you yourself wanna step up from a toy drone. And that is the DJI Spark. So let's pretend it's right here just for a second because I actually sold my Spark a while back. The Spark was an incredible little drone. It was easy to learn. It had awesome intelligent flight modes. It had some little cool little tricks that you could do with it. And the cool thing about it, even my son and my wife and my stepfather were comfortable flying that drone, where they're not comfortable flying my Mavic Pro or my Mavic 2 Pro. It's extremely light and portable. You know, the connectivity is not as great as the Mavic Pro or the Mavic 2 Pro, 
but for the price, it's great. And right now at DJI, they're offering some great discounts on it. For under $400, you're getting an amazing little drone. And I would highly recommend it if you're looking for that first timer. Now I do have a tie for this one, the best drone for a beginner. Another one to look at is the DJI Tello. And the reason I say that, for those young people in your life that are interested in getting into drones. The Tello is technically still a toy drone, but it's an amazing toy drone. It has downward vision positioning. It's so stable for a $79 drone. And yes, it's $79 right now, normally $99. So there are cheap drones online that you can get for $79 that don't have the image quality or the stabilization of the Tello. Now I had the Tello when it first came out a while back, but I actually gave that one away to a young man and I hope he's having a lot of fun with it. So if you're looking for a great drone that's better than cheap toy drones online for that young person in your life that you wanna get into drones, then I recommend the Tello. Now you'll notice that I did not mention one drone in this video and that is the Mavic Air. When the Mavic Air was released, I actually sold my Spark to help pay for it. And I do regret that because I really miss my Spark. Now don't get me wrong, the Mavic Air is a good little drone, but there's a couple of reasons that I didn't talk about it today and that I think you should probably avoid it. And those things are the noise and the connectivity issues. I'm not trying to be a ninja or anything when I'm flying, but this thing is just so annoyingly loud. And the second thing and the most important thing is the connectivity. I am always losing video signal with the Mavic Air. Even when I'm like 100 feet away, I'm losing signal if there's even a single tree in the way. And so that's why I think if you're gonna spend the money on a new drone this holiday season, I think you should spend that money on the Mavic Pro, especially when you can get the Fly More Combo Kit for $929. Now I'm gonna put links down in the description for everything that I told you about today, as well as some other discounts on drones that I have found online. And I'm gonna update that on a daily basis until we get through the holiday season. So be sure to save this video in a playlist so you can keep checking to see if the discounts get better and better. Now, if you've had the patience to stick around long enough, I'm gonna give you guys something for the holiday season. This is the season of giving, and I feel like I need to give you guys something for helping make this year so awesome on this channel. It's been a wonderful experience. I've had so much fun visiting with you guys, and I wanna give something back this time of year. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you guys a chance to win one of four $25 Amazon e-gift cards. And all you have to do is four simple things. The first thing that you have to do is be a subscriber to the channel. Hopefully that's done already. The second thing is comment below where you're from. Where are you from in the country or in the world or wherever you are? I wanna know where you guys are from because it's kind of interesting to see where you guys are watching from. Third, go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at 51drones. And the reason I want you to do that is because it's an even easier way for you and I to communicate with each other. And last thing, I'm gonna put a channel right up here. It's gonna pop out right there it is go ahead and click on that link and subscribe to that channel. If you guys enjoy my content, you're gonna enjoy this content right here. So go ahead and click on that and subscribe to that channel. Of course, I know that one's gonna be on the honor system, but I trust you guys. So that's it for this video. I hope I gave you some valuable information that'll help you make an informed decision this holiday season. If I did, please click on that thumbs up. Let me know that you liked the video. I wanna thank you guys for subscribing and for watching today. As always, fly safe and fly safe.